Well, hello, Bishop Patrick L. Wooden seeing you here. You can tell I'm not in my office, but I'm actually at the new memorial that we have here at the church, showing sermons and sermons and sermons and messages and songs and different things that yours truly have preached down through the years since I've been here in the city of Raleigh. I'm very appreciate, appreciative to the anniversary committee for having this done. And as you can see, as we get down toward the end, the hands of uh, my hands are cleft and they are uh, bruised as we work the work of the Lord. What a privilege it is to be a Christian in a day like today. Now, listen, I'm excited about tonight. Tonight is the first night of our women's weekend. I want to thank my wife, Pamela, and the, the committee of the women's uh, weekend for even allowing me uh, to be a part of it. I know on Thursday night, it's, it is normally uh, my Bible study night where we study the word of the Lord together. But tonight I am going to be preaching the word of the Lord, uh, being a part of the women's weekend anointed with fresh oil, women standing on God's truth. And the Lord has visited me and given me a special, special message for tonight. So I want to invite you to come women and men alike. There is a word from the Lord. I tell you, you have to admit we've been on a high. God has been speaking and preaching and using us uh, throughout this year. We we're in our 22nd week back at the upper room uh, uh, more and God has kept us. He's kept COVID away and the word of the Lord has been coming with with power and authority. God has opened us up to audiences that we've never had before. Our YouTube and Facebook audience, thank you for joining us from around this country, from even around this world. Thank you for tuning in and sharing and praying for us and supporting us. This is an awesome time to be a Christian. God is doing great things, and I am armed tonight with a word from the Lord that is going to make a difference. I guarantee you this, women and men alike, you will see yourself if you have spiritual eyes to see. If you can see spiritually at all, you will see yourself differently walking out of the church than you did coming in because you will see that you're God's property and that he loves you. And he died for you. He has an assignment for you and he's going to use us in these last days. We have been called for such a time as this, as this. And I'm going to tell you, I'm excited. I'm fired up and I look forward to to ministering the word of the Lord to you tonight right here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ. Come early. Come and get a good seat. And for those who can't come, now we're still social distancing and all of that. We will still be online, YouTube Live and Facebook Live. But let me tell you, if you can get here, tonight is uh, the night that you want to be here. All of the women, all of the men be in place and hear the word of the Lord. God bless you. I will see you tonight here at the Upper Room Church of God in Christ.